What are the most important factors in determining which clean room classification is needed? One of the most important factors is that you have to determine is what size particle causes me a problem? Is it any size particle? Is it a certain size range of particle or so forth? And what you mostly find is people look at their the clean room classification when they're trying to decide what classification they need and they go to the lowest level particle count as an example is they think they need an ISO 5 clean room which is a class 100 clean room and they say I need less than 100 particles so I must need a class 100 clean room but if that particle is half a micron in size or 5 micron in size that would be a significant difference so in, 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 that, in that equation is if they think they're, they're looking at a particle of half a micron but the, really the particle that's a problem for them is a five micron particle. If you look at the array from a clean room classification, that translates instead of an ISO five clean room or class 100, it translates into an ISO eight clean room or a class 100,000.